Hey guys, what's up? It's Golem Guy, and welcome back to another video. In this video, I'll be reviewing Alu Fun Park in Athens, Greece. I'm in Greece right now, and I went to Alu Fun Park yesterday. I loved it. It was a great park. Very underrated. I don't think any enthusiast has ever visited that park before. So I'm probably the first, or one of the first. Let's talk about the rides here. They have some pretty good rides. They have this small uh, family roller coaster called Big Apple. It's like a zero coaster. It was actually pretty fun, a lot more fun than I expected. And they also have probably one of the best log flumes I've ever seen. Um, it's called La Ila. You just go up this one smaller hill and then you drop down. And then you just go around in some turns and then you go up a second left hill and then you drop. It's a very cool log flume ride and Alu Fun Park, I think they have a pretty good collection of rides. Of course their highlight attraction is a roller coaster called Loop It, but it was not operating when it was there. And anyways, I've seen videos on YouTube and it looked pretty rough. Loop It was a very small looping coaster. It was like a good family thrill coaster. I think it was like an inner park wild wind or something like that. I don't think they have any in North America. So it didn't really look like the best ride and it was kind of good that it broke down. Let's talk about the ambiance of the park. It kind of felt like a fair mix with an amusement park. Probably the thing I'd compare this most to in Canada is um, Peony Playland in Vancouver. But this park is pretty nice. The ambiance is a lot nicer than I expected. They have a lot of trees. There's some interlock pathways. It's very beautiful. There's some theming around. It's a pretty nice park. And they have some food options that look pretty good. I didn't have any food there, but they had this one place that served hot dogs and they had this restaurant. It was a ch it's a chain restaurant in Greece. It's called Everest. They serve like sandwiches and salads and stuff. So they have a pretty good uh, collection of food for a very small park. And this park was weird because it was a paper ride park. I thought it was gonna be a, an admission park where you go in and pay for admission and then you can go on as many rides as you want, like Canada's Wonderland or Cedar Point. But I, it wasn't like that. I really like this park and I think when you're in Europe, you should visit Alu Fun Park too. Bye everybody and thanks for watching.